Hi guys, welcome to my channel. My name is CKT Chaotic. Today I'll be reading Down to Earth episode 188. Sorry, my baby's gonna be propped up for a little bit, but if he gets fussy, I'll take a pause and uh, try to soothe him. But yeah, he just, he likes to look around. So um, let's go ahead and get started. My Zeta. Oh, he's pooping. Oh, hold on. Let me adjust him so he doesn't have a blowout here. Okay. 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 All right. Why are you out of bed? Oh, my poor sweet Zeta. Remember what we spoke of? Why are you disobeying me? I set rules for you to keep us safe. Do you not care about your family? My Zeta. You clearly do not understand. By leaving, Zodia will have no fuel. The planet needs you. If you leave, not only your family, but all Zodians, they will die. An entire race will be obliterated, all because of your selfishness. All that blood will be on your hands. Ooh. Do you truly wish for that? I... I will give you one more try. Excuse me? Tell me the truth about what I am truly being used for. If you can't do that, then... then I will stay. Zeta, our planet needs you. Do not question... Liar! Zeta! Ding. Oh my god. Huh? Oh my gosh. Open the door this instant! Huh? I did not know what I was doing. The banging was so distracting. Click, click. I aimlessly pressed buttons without hesitations. And then... Zeta! Oh my gosh. Oh. She's crying. Sorry. They. I am certain Zodia is fine. <laughs> but deep down, I wonder if it was true. It's okay. You're okay. And that's what's important. Even if it's true, they didn't have to treat you horribly. If you were important, as they said, they should have been better to you. Thank you, Kate. I know this is a lot to take in. Yet, you remain patient with me. Oh. I appreciate you so much. Are you trying to talk? What did I say? I could have not chose a better planet to crash on. Uh, so the horns, they aren't permanent? No, they will fall off naturally. Then the only issue is you'll have to stay hidden while you have them. That's not bad. I can uh, take care of you till they go away. I would love that. So, does this mean you're moving back in? Down to earth. I love how he is so supportive of her. Like, ugh. He didn't freak out. He didn't judge her. But, like, he just... He he saw her vision. Like, literally. It's so nice that she could do that. Yes, baby? It's so nice that she can do that. Like, imagine, like we're able to like just communicate with people and share a vision to them so they understand and see it instead of like listening to people's telling the story and you're just like questioning like did this really happen because she's able to just like 
play it from her mind and transfer the data or whatever she saw to the person. And I just love that he sees all of this and he just like, well, I'm glad you're here. I'm glad that you're safe and that, you know, and of course it sucks because, you know, Zeta really don't know if Zodia is still out there. If she really was this planet or this place lifeline, you know, so it does suck. She might be the lad Zodian, the last one ever. Who knows, right? But it's kind of scary because if she, if the planet is still there or still exists, I'm very sure the people, that royal family, are literally still out there searching for her and probably visiting each planet to look for her. And who knows? Maybe they, they might be like, um, what's his name? I forgot. I'm, I'm blanking out. It's from Marvel. What's his name? I'm black. Oh my gosh. I'm going to remember it the next read and I'm like, oh my god. No, no, I can't remember. Mommy brain. Anyways, you try to like obliterate, wipe out a whole like species of living things. Okay, I'll make sure he's like not spitting up on me. But yeah, anyways, I'm not making any sense right now. I'm sorry, guys. I'm lacking sleep and I've been working 10 hour shifts just so I can have three days off and taking care of this little nugget middle of the night. And yeah, so uh, my brain is literally cooked. Literally cooked just for you. Thanos. There you go. Him. Going around just like clearing out all these people from their planet. Because he feels like there's too many people in this world. Too many living things and he needs to make set things right so he clear out half of each species. Yes. I know. Alright, I've been ranting long enough. Let's go ahead and uh, clock out. What should we read next? Oh, he spit up on me. All right, bye guys.